tough game. Um, thought we had a real good side with a real good training week. Built on a lot from last week with a lot of work-ons and I think in the first half against uh, with a bit of wind, we played well. We, uh, we thought we were solid. I thought second half we had the chance to win the game. Uh, did a couple of runaway tries and we got, got away from us so we chased the game for the last five minutes. Um, but I thought it was a good performance and there's a lot of positive going into next week. Um, I mean, first of all, thanks very much to Oakley Rugby Club. This is a, a beautiful rugby club, beautiful setting, um, really enjoyable place to uh, to come. Um, and also thanks to, uh, I obviously heard a few London Scotch supporters up here supporting the, the guys as well, which is just absolutely fantastic. Um, I know I've probably said this quite a few times after, after games, but a, a sense of frustration because I, I felt uh, our first half there and probably for the majority of the game we were very much in control um, and uh, putting some very good stuff together in some tricky conditions uh, and then just uh, I, I, I suppose a few individual errors were kicked out on the full line out faulted a little bit um, uh, and from those turnovers we just didn't transition well enough uh, and credit to, to Carnegie they, they capitalized on it um, but I, you know, I want to pick out some positives here. We uh, we set off at 6:45 this morning on on the coach, and to a man, I can't fault the attitude of our, our players in any way at all. I, I think they took that field full of pride for the for the shirt, knowing what they wanted out of the game, knowing uh, the the attitude and effort that they, that they had to to put in. So it, we just need to look at uh, some some of those errors that, that cost us. But attitude-wise, I'm really proud of this group of players.